So first off, here's an assignment, and let's say I'm a student. I'm going to open this Oceans assignment, and in the upper right, there's a little Immersive Reader button. And when I click it, I get the full Immersive Reader for my instructions. So I'm going to go here, click Play. Instructions. For this assignment, I'd like you to first go through the So I get the full Immersive Reader right here in Assignment. So I can change the background color, increase spacing, I can translate, picture dictionary, all of those things. I can go full screen as well, right here in the upper right, right for the assignment. So that's very inclusive. Now we're going to show Immersive Reader for conversations and chat. So I'm on any message in the posts right here, and I go to the dot, dot, dot menu, and I choose Immersive Reader right here. And I click it. It launches the full Immersive Reader, so I can start reading out loud. Ocean's discussion today. Hi, class, for today's discussion. I'd like you to be sure. So I'll hit pause at the bottom, and I can change the voice speed, faster, slower, male or female voices. I can do all the same parts of Immersive Reader. So I can change the background color. I can increase spacing. Maybe I want it blue here. Maybe I'll put on line focus. I can even translate. So if I want to translate right here, I'm going to scroll down and change this into Spanish. And now maybe I'll just change the entire document to Spanish. Choose Read Aloud. Me gustaría que estuviera seguro y leyera las páginas de la asignación de... And if I want to go back to the original, I click on top. So really easy to launch right from any post. In addition, this is also enabled in chat. So if I go to the chat and appear in the upper left, here's a message that I have and I can just hover in the same way and click the dot 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 and drop it down and choose Immersive Reader in the chat. And I can get the exact same type of message play. For today's discussion, I'd like you to be sure and read the pages from yesterday's assignment. 